Thinking about recovering metals from e-waste? Here are three common pitfalls to avoid. Not all printed circuit boards are equal. Buying bulk without verifying composition is a fast track to poor yields and hidden costs. Always validate the feedstock through proper sampling assays. Gold, copper, palladium, silver vary widely between sources. As wastes are typically non-homogeneous, they are very difficult to sample accurately for purchasing, processing, and payment. Total metal content doesn't equal recoverable value. Some metals won't leach or melt efficiently or might get lost in the process. Build your flow sheet based on recoverable metals, not just elemental content. Elements like tin, arsenic, bismuth, or iron might seem minor, but they can poison your process or trigger smelter penalties. Know what's in your feed or be ready for extra treatment costs, lower purity, and damaged equipment. E-waste recovery isn't plug and play. Smart sourcing and smart design make all the difference. Follow us for more tips on clean, profitable metal recovery.